Thanks for watching Mid Morning this Wednesday. A couple of airline industry stories are in the headlines today. Oh, and they're both going to make you mad. <laughs> I promise. First, let's talk about baggage fees. You know, airlines are just in the tank. Times are tough. They collected $4.2 billion in baggage fees last year. That is a 10% increase from 2015. Wow, that's a big job. Well, yeah, they're so strict mm. on enforcing the size of carry-ons now. More oh, people yeah. have to check them. And just when you thought that legroom space couldn't get any tighter, yeah, thanks American Airlines. They announced on some planes they are cutting legroom in economy class. Ooh. Ah, yes, the airlines, we love to hate them. But we shop for the cheapest price, and airlines say these are the little things they need to do to keep the sticker price low. So should we start? Let's start with legroom. Sure. Not a huge concern for Kylie. Mm, no. Five foot <laughs> two. Five foot three. three. Five foot I three. am absolutely it's five foot three. Jet. I'm five eleven. But you get sure. the you get the seat in front of you. It feels a little claustrophobic, even if you have short legs. It's because of people who recline their seats. Those are monsters. Do okay. We, we, we are not I'm getting into that. We're on the same in. side. On All this right. Topic. That is not so what this is about. Let's talk about the legroom. American <laughs> yeah. uh, bought a fleet of new jets. They'll have about ten more seats on these. And the old 737. Only 18 seats will have this 29 inch legroom kind of clearance. And just to like give you an idea, like 28 inches is industry minimum. That's spirit. That's like worst of the worst. Do yeah. your legs hit, Matt, mm -hmm. when you're at 28? 28 inches? They, I think they hit it about like 30, 31. So wow. like even on United yeah. Flight Spirit for sure. It like, makes a big it's difference. Very it really does. Yeah. A Delta is about 30, Southwest mm -hmm. about 30. And then 31. Uh, uh, 31, depending yeah. on And then what Jet part. Blue goes up to 34. 34. The luxury, Ooh. my goodness. You can Those stretch. extra three <laughs> inches. I worry that this will become something that American is kind of the first big airline to do this. We know that Spirit does it. Sure. But if the bigger airlines start doing this and cutting them back, I hope we don't see Delta and United going in that direction. I mean, too. airlines have cut the number of flights, and so they're jamming to get 10 yeah. more seats yeah. on a flight. That is uh, meaningful for them. Uh, they you say they have more flights too. That's well, you could true. do that. Yeah. So let's talk about those baggage fees. They were uh, some of the airline people were testifying in Washington D.C. yesterday, and they said, "Look, uh, ticket prices are as low as they were 25 years ago. In some cases, lower than 25 years ago." But Matt, you don't feel it when you're paying 25, 50 bucks a bag to check your bag. No, and I mean traveling with a you know a family now. You and I have both yeah. families of four. Yeah. You, you, those bigger suitcases sure. that does add up quick. You go away bucks. for a week, you've got two big suitcases. Three they suitcases. say it's for choice. That mm -hmm. you know, yeah. if someone like Kylie doesn't want to check a bag, it's keeping yeah. your ticket price low. Well, I think that makes sense to an extent. I just feel like they're at the point where they just nickel and dime you wherever they can. It does seem like their profits yeah. are pretty good. They're doing okay. <laughs> pretty good. Right Don't right. take away our leg room. Mm. Their leg room. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kyle. Yeah. I'm on your side, even yeah. though I won't ever reach. They've got to go down to like 20 inches for my knees. <laughs> <laughs>